Now the hawk is back. This is November 16th, 2010. He isn't budging. I noticed there's been a couple less squirrels and a couple less blue jays around. It's kind of cloudy and rainy out here today, so I don't know how long I'm going to stay out here. I'm still in my pajamas. I'm giving my neighbors a thrill. And my feet are getting wet. Looks like it's got its back turned towards me. Yeah, it's quite a ways away from me, as you can see. But who knows, maybe I'll catch it in action later today. I would have thought by this cool weather, it, uh, I don't know where these things migrate to, but I think it would still be here. But obviously it is. Well, as luck would have it, my feet were getting wet. So I went in the house to put on some bedroom slippers and the hawk, uh, just as I was closing the door, chased up a bunch of birds and moved to another limb. So I'm back out in the dampness, but at least with dry feet. But still in my pajamas with my pervaded neighbors looking out the windows at me, wondering what in the hell is he up to now? Maybe I ought to swing the camera around towards him and wave to him. I'll give him something to talk about. I can't complain. I got good neighbors, but I got a couple weird ones, a couple doors over. Now the hawk's not moving. He's surveying his territory. He's a good 350, maybe 400 feet away from me, all the way to the back corner of my yard. I'll zoom out and you can see how far away he is. Zoom back in, there he is. Well, I think I've given the neighbors enough of a thrill, so I'm going to go back in, sit down where it's dry, and have a cup of coffee, and uh, keep an eye on this thing, see if it moves, and get the camera again. Well, the cats joined me out in the sunroom. I turned on the space here to get my feet dry. 
She's wondering what all the fuss is about. She likes to catch birds, but I think this one's a little bit too big for her. Huh? You want to go out and catch that bird? I think he'll catch you. Yeah. Katie. Huh? Well, Katie said if that bird shows up, I'm ready for it. She's just had her breakfast, so I think she's got her belly full, so she's not going to be concerned with any bird. Well, as things were to have it, I think the hawk has flown the tree. I went in for a while and uh, just came back out. Up there it goes. <laughs> 